Everyone's talking about Notebook LM and Gemini right now, but most people are using them wrong. And in this video, I'm going to share with you three Gemini secrets that 99% of people don't know. And each one of these secrets is so good that if I only knew one of them, I would still stop using ChatGPT projects and Claw projects because they just don't compare to these three Gemini secrets. Most people upload documents to projects just to summarize them or have conversations with them, but they never generate any assets from those documents. And that is a complete waste of an opportunity. A couple of months ago, I went to the emergency room. I found out there were some things I needed to work on, so I created a ChatGPT project, and it was very helpful to me. The conversations were great, but that's where it stopped. So I switched everything over to Notebook LM, and I was able to generate assets that helped me understand things on a deeper level and also process it visually, audibly, and have something on hand that I could look at in my phone to keep me on track on a daily basis. And so maybe you want to switch your projects over to Notebook LM like me, then all you have to do is open up your project. I'm going to open my health project, and then if you click on files, you can easily download your files. But Corey, what about all of these conversations that you've had in this project? How are you going to get these conversations over into Notebook LM? Because I'm sure there are some details and memories that you're leaving behind. And that's very simple. We're going to open up this right here. And at the very top of this conversation, you can see a Notebook LM tab. All I have to do is click on this and then choose the existing notebook. Choose the notebook that I want this conversation to go into. And it's automatically going to be imported into my new health notebook inside Notebook LM. So very quickly, I want to show you two must have Chrome extensions that you need to add right now to fully take advantage of Notebook LM and Gemini that a lot of people are not using. The first one is this YouTube to Notebook LM Chrome extension. Instead of you copying and pasting single YouTube links into Notebook LM, this is going to allow you to import several hundred videos of a single channel into Notebook LM. This is why you see the Notebook LM extension right here inside YouTube, wherever I am, because I have this Chrome extension installed that allows me to import entire channels, entire playlists, or videos if I want to. And the second Chrome extension that you want to download is this one right here named Cortex, because this is the one that allows me to import my chat GPT, Claw, and even Gemini conversations into the notebook that I choose. So make sure you go to the Chrome web store, install these two Chrome extensions if you want to follow along with this workflow. Now back to the video. And once I've transferred my chat GPT project to Notebook LM, I can create audio overviews that are interactive podcasts that allow me to chime in and actually ask questions of the podcast host. Or I might want to create an infographic I can keep on my phone that's going to remind me of my primary fitness goals and where I'm headed every day. Or if I come into Gemini, I can click on the add files, choose Notebook LM, and then I can choose my personal fitness and health optimization protocol notebook or several others if I want to. Put together a grocery list for meals I can eat this week. That will be low in carbs, high in fat. I think I'm gonna go for a little bit of keto. And just like that, you can see that Gemini is putting it together and it's creating my diet accordingly. And if you look right here, you can see all of these small little citations are directly linked to my notebook. And so that workflow with the health is powerful, but something that I immediately started to understand and see is that not only was Notebook LM taking the place of ChatGPT and Claude projects, but it was also taking the place of memory inside of both of those platforms. With ChatGPT and Claude, the memory is native to the platform and the space they give you is very small. But Notebook LM is like your own personal library where you can store vast amounts of information. On the free plan alone, you get 100 notebooks, 50 sources per notebook, and each source can hold up to 500,000 words. That means that Google is giving you the opportunity to save 2.5 million words in a single Notebook LM account. And when you learn the third Gemini secret that we're going to show you in this video, you're going to instantly understand how Notebook LM gives Gemini more memory than anything that OpenAI or Claw could ever hope to give you. So if personal AI is something that you're looking for, then Gemini is going to be the best platform for you. Summarize everything that you learned about me in this conversation, and then to summarize it is core biometrics and health status, recent medical history, my my weight loss goals, key bottlenecks. And if I come over to Gemini and I ask it, what are the three things that you learned about me most recently? Then it's going to list back those same three things because it's updating in real time. So then all I have to do is click save to note. And then once it's done saving, click on the three dots and convert the source. And now everything that I had in this conversation is saved over here. And if I want to, I can come to the top right here and I can delete chat history. And I don't have to worry about anything that we learned during this conversation being lost because I've already updated it over here as a source. Now for the business side, this is Gemini secret number three. Notebook LM is blind to the internet and that's by design, unless you input the sources. Gemini is fast and it knows a lot, but it doesn't know your particular business rules or your particular workflows. But what happens when you connect them? What happens when you treat Notebook LM like your brain and you treat Gemini like your hands? One thing that happens is you stop
stop copying and pasting 2000 word prompts. You stop setting up virtual private servers to store your prompts and you stop doing all of these complicated workarounds to try to get your workflows together inside of chat GPT or Claude, because now you can easily execute infinite workflows inside of notebook LM and Gemini. And just in case you didn't know, each of these prompts is several thousand characters long. They will quickly burn through my tokens and claw chat GPT will struggle with them, but notebook LM and Gemini handle them easily all day long. No problems, no slowing down. You keep moving fast. You keep building. So Gemini and notebook LM is the AI that I'm going to be working with, with my workflows going forward in the future. One of my absolute favorite use cases for projects inside of chat GPT was agent builder. Agent builder didn't have any files. And the reason why is because the file path inside of chat GPT is corrupted and it has a very difficult time reading the file. And so what I did was I created a link registry that will read the links from my virtual private server and then import the prompts there. And I will upload them through NAN. There was this whole workflow that I had. And so what I did was I took the links from the link registry. I pasted them inside of notebook LM and uploaded them as sources. I opened up configure notebook and I pasted in my router prompt. And guess what happened? Notebook LM executed the prompts exactly as it was supposed to with pure reasoning, pure logic. And it didn't take any time printing out the prompts. It was super fast. This would have taken chat GPT minutes to perform. But then I realized something. How am I going to build an agent that's going to help me build the retention of my YouTube videos inside notebook LM unless I import data. And so you can look over here to the left where I began to import data. And then I had an idea. All I need to do is come back to Gemini, choose my notebook, click add, click get started. Gemini is going to read the notebook and execute the prompts in the exact order that it's supposed to. Agent Build OS version 12 initialized, entering boot and intake. What is the number one goal you want this agent to achieve or the number one problem to solve? Brain dump a natural language and it's pulling directly from the agent. And so now I've uploaded an agent to the chat and not just a notebook because it's filled with system prompts. And so I paste in the same response from notebook LM because notebook LM only operates off of the data you upload, but now it's connected to Gemini. So it's able to pull from the information on the internet and from the information available to it in the world. So don't let this overwhelm you. Let's lock in the workflow one last time before you go. First, use the Chrome extension to migrate your data instantly. No more copy and pasting. Second, we use asset generation to turn that boring data into active coaching. Third, we use the save to source loop to fully cure AI amnesia and take advantage of those 2.5 million words we can save inside our notebook LM account. And most importantly, we use the Gemini bridge to give your static notebook notebook, live hands on the internet, and to upload agents to the Gemini chat. If you master these three, you don't need another subscription. You have a complete personal operating system. But this is just the tip of the iceberg. There's so much more that you could do with Notebook LM and Gemini. If you want to see more tips and tricks with Notebook LM, then make sure you check out this video right here where I turn Notebook LM into my own creative agency.